I was like, I didn't realize that you sing as well. That was mm-hmm. something that I just had never. I guess I'd just seen the guitar, um, the guitar side of things, um, and I, I was kind of in, intrigued to hear like what you've learned from doing that. That maybe yeah. you feel that guitarists or actually just even musicians that don't use their voice, maybe yeah. what you feel you've learned from that. That um, if you could maybe share a piece of your experience. Yeah, I think I've I've learned. You just missed. I've learned sorry, who I, I really am as a musician. Oh, sorry. I was really sorry. I just interrupted a really important statement with oh, the fact that you missed my my pun. Oh no, sorry. I, th- I th- thought it, 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 I didn't hear you. Sorry, I just I said if you could, it was something like a, what did I say? A pizza, your experience, or a pizza? Your, <laughs> anyway, sorry. I interrupted your really <laughs> profound statement. That I'm sure had lots to it. So please carry on. <laughs> See, yeah, I think I discovered who I am as a musician through it, um, because. Mm, the years prior to that, I was doing a lot of instrumental music, guitar-oriented music, fusion, those types of things. And in a way, I did it, now with hindsight, I feel like I did it because I felt like I needed to and that's what people expected me to do. I was trying to please someone that wasn't me. and. With the singing, I realized my unashamed love for vocal music, which has always been, has, has had always been there, but I've kind of neglected that in my pursuit of becoming like a virtuoso guitar player type thing. And the singing really opened my eyes to the fact that what I want to be doing is not that. I'm, I want to be more of a, of a musician, overall musician, than a guitar player. Uh, so for me, like you cannot see this part of my studio here, but over here I have my my, my keyboards and synthesizers. Um, and I love spending time with those every bit as much as I like enjoy spending time on the guitar. And I like to be in my vocal booth over there just as much as I like being on the synths. So... Unfortunately, my new record isn't still isn't out yet because I'm still <laughs> I'm still going through some you know some promotional setup and those types of things. It's been it's been finished for over a year now. I'm trying to get it out, and I think that new record really represents where my head is at. Unfortunately, the world hasn't heard of it. I've I've been with these I've been listening to these tunes for four years now, but the world hasn't heard them. But I talk from a perspective of uh, of of the music I'm making now that I really identify with. And that music would have not happened unless I had become a singer. And I'm not even not even a singer in that sense. I'm somebody who wants to sing their original music. I don't have the ambition to be like a professional studio singer, professional live singer. I just want to... I, I use it as a, the voice as a utility to make my own music. And that's what I've really learned about myself. That's what I want to be. I don't want to be a vir- virtuoso guitar player per se. I don't want to be a session musician. I want to be doing original music, and I want to have voice. The, I want to have the voice as one of the primary instruments in there. That's what I've learned. 